Hey guys, this is Four Drills, an episode on the Turning server. In the last episode, we built this. Synthetic sounds need to go down. I'll just take the block stuff down and put this down a little bit too. All right, in the last episode, we built this baby. I don't think we're gonna be getting to the interior world just yet because I've had this plan. I'm making a basement. Which I started to dig out right here, but I didn't want to do too much off camera without telling the plan and stuff. So the plan's gonna be that once we dig that out, we're gonna have a hole in our garage and we're gonna have a car hanging from the ceiling. So it looks like kind of like an auto repair place. You know, sometimes they have like the underground area. So yeah, I'm gonna build be building that and who knows, I might even turn this garage into like a I can make like a garage sale or something where to sell all the crap I don't need. Cause that sounds like a pretty original idea. I totally came up with it. I'm mean, no, actually, Paper Turtle gave me the idea. The idea, I'm pretty sure. Or was it? I'm just gonna say it was Paper. Yeah, I'm gonna finish digging this out, and I'll get. I'll come back with you guys. All right, the area has been dug out, so now I'm just putting the stone brick wall in. To give it that like basement look. I was thinking cobblestone, but that seemed like it would be too like I don't know. It just didn't seem like it would really like fit. But it probably could. But you know, I'm just gonna try to be classy and see stone brick. So yeah, update done. I'll get back to you guys when the walls are put down. All right, the room is done. So now we just have to. We have the hole right here. So. Let's go to my base and grab some iron. Or do I have iron on me? I don't. So uh, let's go to my base and we're gonna fill that in with iron bars. So it kind of looks like it's like gated off. You guys will see. Oh my! I had smooth stone cooking. I forgot. Uh, let's get more in. Yeah, I can. And boop. Alright. I'm trying to have a stack of smooth stone, in case you haven't noticed. And I also need to get organized. But if you come in here, we'll see. I have my iron. I'll take a little bit more with me just in case I need to. Just in case it's required. Alright, so let's see how it looks if we do this. Oh yeah, because yeah, you guys haven't noticed I'm using a 3D resource pack to like make items have more like depth and stuff to them. And that actually looks really cool with 3D textures. So we're gonna put you could be you know, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna be putting a car, a car like on top of this. Maybe hang it from the roof. So yeah, if you want to like a short way down, we can just hop through there, which I'm gonna do, please. Yeah, that's really cool. And then we can put like a, like some scenery down here, maybe like some machines. I hope you guys see the idea that I'm going for. But so on one of these walls, I do plan to make it like a storage room wall, cause my house needs like some purpose. Yeah, this seems like it's gonna do it for this episode. Oh, that that was. Oh yeah, my alone, cause Maxwell just left. So yeah, I'm, there's a chance I might have some footage with Maxwell of us building a zombie XP farm. If not, you might be able to expect that in the next episode. But, that seems, oh yeah, by the way, I did add, I added this little door, doorway to the roof. Ooh, that looks cool. I probably shouldn't be spoiling it because I don't know if it's been uploaded or not, but that does look cool. But uh, yeah, that seems like it's going to do it for this episode. Unless you guys see the extra footage. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.
Yo, what is up guys? It's Maxbook here and welcome back to Tourney and SMP episode 2 for me. I'm not sure what episode it is for you, but we are here with Forge World. Yep, this is actually episode 3 for me. Yeah. So, in this episode, we are going to be building a mob farm. An XP grinder, whatever you want to call it. And yeah. So we have sort of the foundation. Uh, not really foundation. What, what would you call this? Um, hole. Yeah, we have the hole dug out. <laughs> Actually, get rid of that on top there. And yeah, so basically what we get, we have to do is um, figure out where they're going to go. So I want them to go this way because this way sort of points towards spawn. Whoa, is there? Do you see this, these waters on the floor? These little water splashes? <laughs> no. <laughs> okay, I guess it's just a black witch because I see it on my screen. <laughs> <laughs> You're going crazy. All right, so... Where do we want them to go? Oh, wait. Uh, I should probably put those back. Uh, and then they're just going to go up a couple blocks. Uh, okay. Sorry if this is, uh, if this gets a bit confusing. Uh, okay, so I think this is all they really need to go to. I'll put a block there representing that's the ceiling. And, okay, so let's just start placing the water a little bit here. Right. So, uh, we're gonna do that, and then we want to switch this out for signs, and then put a sign there. I'm gonna need more water uh, there, and then I actually think this is going to have to be the uh, where the spawner ends. So here, right here is where that's going to end. And then they're going to drop into the thing here. So, this is going to be the crusher right here. We're not doing it like the normal fall here. You can come through here, I think. Come through here. Oh, God, I just oh. broke the sign. <laughs> All right, here, ah. place that back. Place that there. Done. All right. Oh. Oh, my God, we did it again. <laughs> All right, so this is already looking good. We're doing this pretty fast. Um, yeah. I'm going to grab some more water from the source so that we can start on the actual, like, flow from down here. Let me just make sure this works. So if I were to fall down here, mobs always press space when they're in water, pretty much. So, you'd, like, hit there, then, yeah, you'd yeah. go under eventually. What if we had to stay right here? Would that, like, kind of help, I wonder? Or, no, not right there, but... I don't know. It might, actually. Yeah, do you want Then they would land here. This is where we would want them to land. Or actually, we probably don't even need the. We, could, we probably don't even need this block up here. It would probably help if we just do this. There we go. I'm just gonna mine this out one more block here, Ooh. and then this is going to be the spawner sort of main house here. So this is going to be the staircase that goes up. I'm not sure when I'm gonna hit the surface. Hopefully, pretty soon. I didn't go. This it's, this uh uh this spawner isn't too far underground. It is right beside the monuments Iguana's building, though. Yeah, it's actually really close. How's going to be further? Yeah, yeah. I didn't expect a mob farm or a, a spawner to like be right at spawn. They don't call it a spawner for nothing. <laughs> that was a good one. That was my drum beat. But um, that's how aliens do drum beats. <laughs> Oh, I found iron. Well, this has been an efficient mining trip. Okay. Yeah, I'm not even anywhere near the surface, I don't think. Oh, wait. I hit dirt, I think. Yeah, here's some dirt. Hopefully, this is the surface. I think it is. Yeah, there's a couple layers. It should be the next layer. Yes, I found the surface. All right, so this is uh, going to be the mob farm entrance right here. I'll start lighting... This area up. What the heck? Talk about holy block glitches. Dude, it's so easy to level up now. Yeah, I know. And then here and here. And we'll mine this up with one more. Uh, actually, wait. That's not going to work. Uh, we'll put something special here, there. Like a, a certain type of block we'll put there. Surrounding the whole spawner type thing will be cobble like that 
and then there, and then there's gonna be a crusher button here, I think. Oh no, wait, the crusher button goes here. So hang on, I'm gonna move this back one more. All right, there we go. So there, now that's like that, and then be like perfect. This. Looks good. And then the mobs would be here, and you would have like glass. Or wait, would you? No, 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 no. Wait, where would the glass go? Maybe. I don't know. We could just like put a row of glass like right there. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Now what we actually have to do is here. Let's make a quick uh, entrance. We'll put like an iron door here, say like maintenance or something. Yeah, that's a good idea. Or wait, huh? That's or... weird. I'm actually gonna make it go out this way. To the point where we hit like the edge and then we can make it like this and the maintenance goes right here and there actually are zombies spawning already oh wow uh, guess... we don't want that for now right now we don't actually want them spawning because i still have to set up all the redstone for this so there we go all right so this is going to be the maintenance thing there's going to be a door there that says maintenance, so I'll just cover that with cobble so we know that that's there. And sweet, so the mob farm is pretty much all done. Uh, that zombie did go through, I believe. Did he? Yeah, and by or the way, died. I guess we could work weird about like making it look pretty at like another, another time. Like we could add like wood stairs and like stone walls or yep. something. Sweet, so they're coming down nicely. So for right now, if they do spawn, we're just going to block this off with three. So you can actually, um, you can actually like punch them or hit them to death. So you can actually get XP already. So yeah, I'm probably going to do the redstone in either a different video or off camera because it's kind of complicated. It takes a while and I'll probably be pausing a lot trying to figure <laughs> out what I have to do. But yeah. So that's all I really wanted to accomplish for this episode. Do you want to do anything else before the end? Because it's only been a couple minutes. Yeah. Um. You know, I don't really think there's that much else to do. Yeah. Um. There is an iron farm that will be in construction soon. I'm waiting for donations. I need hoppers and um, some building materials, glass and uh, wood or cobblestone or whatever, I'm probably just going to build it out of cobblestone and decorate it with logs to make it look nice instead of just like a cobblestone square. <clears throat> yeah. I'm also going to need rails because I have to bring the villagers over via minecart. Yeah, I actually was testing them earlier, so I made rails. I have like 16 you can have. Oh, sweet. Um, actually, you know what? Just drop it in the donation chest that's near the strip mine. All right, I've already donated like forty-three iron. Ish. All right, I'm gonna go and check the donation chest right now. Actually. All right. Sweet. Uh, Snake said he was gonna donate a bunch of blocks too. Oh, sweet. Yeah, you did donate a ton of iron. That's good. We're gonna need that. And I may have donated a potato or two. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. Well, actually, you know what? I'll smelt that iron. I left all my iron and stuff back um back over at the what's it called at the spawner. I think I left my coal there too. Oh no wait, there's coal. There we go. Smelt that iron. I'm gonna go back to the spawner and grab my stuff. Oh wait, I should probably oh no wait, I left coal there, I'm pretty sure. I'm actually going to kill these things. I haven't really been letting you talk. Yeah, it's that's okay though. I'm a very talkative person. And I'm very... And I always just, like, have pauses in my video of silence. That's why I usually do cuts and stuff. Alright, so... I might actually... If I can get to level 30, I'm gonna enchant. Uh, I am, like, half of a bar away. Like, you know, those... Like, a tiny little bar. Yeah, that's, like, the same for me. I'm, like, maybe... I'm, like, Are just you? hit level 29, so I'm gonna do some hunting real fast. Ooh. Yes, level 30, sweet. All right, I'm going to enchant a new diamond pickaxe because as you guys saw last episode, um, I got freaking just efficiency uh, four. 
which is kind of horrible for a level 30 enchant. Oh, the fountain zombie. Oh yeah, the fountain. Oh. That fountain was made by Snackism C. Oh god, I am not gonna die today. Are you sure about that? I'm positive. I have not died yet on the server. Don't make today the first day. Uh, I legit have no wood. Oh wait, here we go, here we go. <laughs> I have three wood left, and I just used um, two of it to make sticks for this new diamond pick I'm going to enchant. Hopefully, we can get a good enchant. I'm hoping for either fortune or silk touch. Uh, either way is fine. Here, I'll just show you guys real quick the pick that I enchanted before. Yeah, so hopefully this one gives me a way better enchant, because efficiency four isn't really that good. But it is good for, like, a mining pickaxe if I just want to go mining. I do have a Fortune 3 iron one, though. You mean Fortune 3? Yeah, Fortune 3. Fortune 3. Oh, I need to collect eggs, too, because I'm making a community egg farm. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> Say it right. Uh, wait, where, did, where am I going? I just ran completely the opposite direction of the enchant table. I wasn't paying attention. All right, come on. Please be good. Okay, it is efficiency 4. Please. Yes! What was it? Okay, no unbreaking, but I did get Silk Touch. Oh, Vicious for Silk Touch? Yeah, that's good. That's good. Oh, nice. It's not Fortune, but I do have a Fortune backup if I need. If I need it. Oh, sweet, dude. That's good. That's good. I needed a Silk Touch one. Oh, oh my god. There's like a million creepers over here. <gasps> Getting a bit of server lag here. Yeah, same. I'm back to 27 levels. I really like the new enchant system. It makes it a Same. heck of a what lot easier fuck? to enchant. What the fuck? Okay. What happened? <laughs> the creepers all just froze in. Oh, fuck! <laughs> <laughs> Did you hear that? Yeah. <laughs> I have a lot of cleaning up to do. Oh, my God. Where was that? Um, it was up in these desert hills up here. Desert mountains. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> GG. Alright guys, so I think that's gonna do it for this episode. I got my Silk Touch pick, yes, I'm actually pretty excited about that. And uh, we've got the uh, basis of the mob farm done. So, uh, what do you what do you want to say before we end off the video? Stay classy, kids. Kids, yeah. That's a great way to refer to your <laughs> subscribers. Um, but yeah, so let's go for five likes on this video. You guys broke that record last time. So you guys can do it again and check out all the members of the server in the description below. And I will see you all later. Bye. Peace out. Have you ever seen that? No, I haven't. Okay, wish me luck in this in chat. Oh, crap. I don't have my lapis. Uh, oh, dude. Let's do the swaparoo. What's the swaparoo? It's like uh, you enchant, you don't look at it, you just exit the crafting table, and I pick it up, I look at it, and basically a noise I make or something I say, like if I laugh, then it's probably going to be horrible. But... Yeah. Alright, enchant, don't look at it, just press E. Uh, grab I already it. saw the has fortune too. On a level 30? Yeah. Well, that's not, that's, well at least it's fortune, but yeah. usually it's three on a level 30. Okay, I'm gonna click it. And, and then press E. It. Oh, I went to, it's only fortune two. I saw it too quickly. This is a, so terrible. <laughs> <laughs> Do I have That's, a curse dude, or something? you got this efficiency four and then a fortune two, and then you have like, how many other four, or like disappointments? Oh my God. So, okay, here's all my enchants in a row. I got efficiency, efficiency 4, fortune 2. Faggot, I told to shut up before the video is asleep now. Then efficiency. <laughs> and then, like, work. another efficiency. And then I get this awesome thing, which is actually, I just won fortune 3, though. And I got an unbreaking 3, and then I get that. Wait, I can't... I can add the fortune 2 with the efficiency 4, fortune 2, and then add the I'm breaking 3 to that. Is there an anvil anywhere? Not that I know of. Alright, well, I'll just do that next episode. Because I'm going to have to end off my video right here. So, okay. peace out.